Today we are going to look at how to upgrade the bundle Tomcat 8 to Tomcat 9 for smart reporting in a Windows OS. First, let's download the newer version of the Tomcat software from the Tomcat homepage. Let's select the core version. Here I have the unzip Tomcat I just downloaded, a backup folder and a shortcut for the existing Tomcat. The existing Tomcat's service needs to be stopped. Now we are going to back up the files we are going to replace in case of a failure or a requirement to reverse the process. We are going to back up the Java parameters for the Tomcat using the edit service command. Then in the bin folder we are going to back up all the jar files and executable files. From the conf folder we are going to back up the server XML file. And finally all the files from the lib folder. Now let's open the downloaded Tomcat folder and start migrating the files starting with the lib folder. For the server XML file I am changing the protocol, however this will depend on your specific connector configuration. Finally we migrate all the jar and executables from the bin folder of the Tomcat 9 to our existing Tomcat 8. Having migrated all the required files for the Tomcat 9 upgrade, let's make sure the process was successful by starting the service from the startup batch file. If the process is successful, we'll see the Catalina start up message after a couple of minutes. Now let's review our system information for the Smart Reporting Console and as we can see, now it says that we have Tomcat 9 installed. Now let's go back and use the shutdown batch file to stop the service. We still need to do some final configurations to the service batch file in order to create our new service. So we are going to replace the service that bat file from the Tomcat 9 folder to the install Tomcat folder. Here we are going to add a script above the self service that bat line. It is included in the knowledge article of this video. We are also going to set the specific Java home path and save the file. Now we are ready to delete the old service and create the new one. In order to do that we are going to open the command prompt and use the delete service command and the name of the old service. As a last step, we are going to run the command to install a new service. This needs to be done in the bin folder. And now, after we refresh the services window, we should be able to see and start the new smart reporting service. Now let's just verify that the console is operational. We have finished upgrading the Tomcat.